In this video, I will show you how to make bacon wrapped breakfast sausage patties. The software for this dish is simply bacon and a roll of breakfast sausage. Now, you don't have to use Whataburger brand sausage, but if it's available, why on earth would you not? The only thing else you will need are some fancy toothpicks and a heavy skillet, which you should be heating over medium heat. To ensure the bacon and sausage both cook enough, we will have to give them each a head start separately. Cut up your breakfast sausage into half inch discs and move them into your skillet. Cook for one minute on each side, then evacuate to the cutting board. Next, add strips of bacon to your skillet and cook them on each side for about a minute and a half. It is very important that you cook each strip of bacon thoroughly at this stage because once the bacon is around the sausage, the middle part of the bacon won't be in direct contact with the skillet, so it may not cook enough if you do not pre-cook it. Just to be safe, I cooked them each until they took on a good bit of color but still remained soft and pliable. Now it's time to wrap. Be careful because the bacon is still quite hot. Wrap a strip of bacon around each of the patties and secure it with a toothpick where the two ends overlap. Add two additional toothpicks around the perimeter to hold everything together. Return the patty to the skillet. I like to flip them about once every minute to a minute and a half until the sausage is cooked through thoroughly and each side is browned. After four to six minutes, remove the patties. Finally, remove the last two toothpicks that you inserted, the ones that don't hold the two ends of the bacon together. While it's true that you can just cook the bacon and the sausage separately, cooking them together is sure to wow your breakfast guests. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel on YouTube where I post new videos every week. I also have detailed instructions on how to make each of my dishes on Instructables.com. I will have a link in the description.